Welcome back to River City Live. Now, I'm usually always the cool kid, but I'm super cool today. Actually, my man Andre Cooper is the cool kid. He's with Legacy Gold Barbecue and Barbecue Sauce, and everybody's just coming in like, what is that smell? It's like uh, the cartoons where the following the smell and floating on it. So thanks for hanging out with us today. Thanks for having me. So your sauce, yes, it's a big deal. But before we get into all of that, this is actually kind of something your dad's dream. Can you break that down for me? My dad, Bob Cooper, Robert Cooper, known as Bob, uh, in 1965, he and my mom, Elizabeth Cooper, they came up with a barbecue sauce recipe that was a mustard and ketchup base with some vinegar. And uh, it became the signature sauces for their line of, signature sauce for their line of restaurants. They had restaurants in Arlington, uh, in, um, on the west side, downtown, uh, whole nine yards. And um, my dad had a dream of taking his sauce and sharing it with the world. Uh, he was local, but he wanted to share it with more. And uh, we talked about it when I was in Denver. I was a youth pastor in Denver in the 90s. And um, he passed in 07, never seeing that dream realized. And I came along, grabbed the mantle, and we've been running, um, nursing this dream for 30 years, and we finally got our sauce bottled and for market, ready for market. So this dream that was just like floating around, it's like, oh, maybe we'll make it happen, it could happen, and then what does it feel like for you and your family to, that it's finally become a reality? Man, it's a dream fulfilled. It's just a lesson for me in, um, in perseverance, uh, never giving up on your dream. Uh, it was in several times where it seemed like it wasn't going to come to pass. You know, I started, life happened. I was a, a husband, a father, a pastor, uh, doing full-time ministry and doing barbecue as well. And uh, life happens, and you start and stop. But this last time, I just sensed the need to go ahead and forge forward. And it's just a dream come true. Nothing like it. Now, I mean, most sauces, a lot of people that are barbecue kind of so they know the mustard by itself or yeah. the ketchup by it, yeah. or maybe uh, the vinegar, but to blend all three, that's a different ver type that I've ever experienced. Yeah, yeah. In the South, typically we have a mustard-based sauce, real tangy. Uh, in uh, Carolinas, they have the thinner uh, um, vinegar-based sauce. Mm -hmm. uh, in Florida, we also have the thick, uh, the sweet ketchup-based sauce. Uh, Texas, of course, that's your thicker sauce, your, your tomato-based sauce. Texas. Yeah. <laughs> and um, in Alabama, there's what's called Alabama white sauce, yeah. which is a mayonnaise-based sauce. Yeah. Well, what we did was, what, what my, my father did, and we preserved the, the recipe, mustard and ketchup, so it's not too tangy, not too sweet, it's always just right. All right. Well, uh, I, you know, obviously I should try the sauce, but you brought some meats with us, so. Yeah. All right, so we got a plate with us, yeah. and then, uh, so throw a little something on there, and then. Yep. So we're gonna go, you know what? Freddie, you feel like playing with us today? I feel like playing. All right, come on, I'm gonna bring out Freddie over here. He is a barbecue connoisseur. Come on, check it out with us. All right, so there's some of our, there's some of our pork, sliced cube pork. And I uh, got some, um, how about we do this? How about we do a rib on there? Okay. And I uh, got some chicken as well. All right, so we, you've got three levels of sauces. <laughs> yes. Mild, medium, and hot. Freddie, what yep. are you thinking? I like hot. You're okay, let's go hot. We all going hot. Let's see hot like. All right. Here's the hot. And um, there you go. Not too much there. All right, so Freddie, you want a fork? I got a fork for you. All right. I'm just going to get grubby and put my hands in it. So. Right. so that's your pork. Mm -hmm. Ooh, there's that heat. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So uh, I do like that blend, that mustard and that ketchup. Uh, yeah, mustard and ketchup. I mean, normally I just do it on my burgers. But to put it in with that, I taste that vinegar a little bit but that heat, and I gotta say, when you get hit with the heat, it's not overbearing. I, f I taste it on the back end, yeah. but sometimes you get heat and you're like, I can't even taste the meat, but uh, it's flavor forward. So you taste the flavor first and then the heat on the back side. All right, Freddie, I'll translate. You're not mic'd up, what do you think? Man, it's excellent. Oh, uh, man. All right. Just right. All right, Freddie is the man, I'll tell you. So if people wanna find your sauces, where would they do that? They can go to our Facebook page, which is LegacyGoldBBQ.com or our, um, our um, excuse me, our website, LegacyGoldBBQ.com, and um, we'll get it to them. All right. Well, uh, yeah, I shared with Freddie. The rest of y'all, I'm so sorry for you. <laughs> Being gone. So, it Andre, happens. It happens. thanks sure. for, for uh, sharing with us, and uh, good luck with you guys moving forward. Thank you. All right. Uh, you know what? I'll be nice. I'll save a little bit for Jana. So let's check in with her now. Just a little bit. <laughs> 